in case the escape out of the carriage vehicle container cage thing, uh, if it wasn't tempting enough, here's another 20 second time save. So when you're heading into the place with the amulet, you want to jump down and don't fall off this cliff, but you're able to grab this jiggling rock here. And I'm just going to show this in physics debug first. And then you want to head uh, in about this direction. Okay, there's some stuff over my head, apparently. Just avoid these rocks. Oh, okay, maybe a little more to the left. But you want to head off in this direction here. I'm just going to speed this up. It's actually easier to see without the physics debug on. But there's a wall over here. And then the stuff on the left, that's the place that you... That's the maze you go through. And let's keep going left, and let me see. I'm getting a little lost here. Okay, once you're here, you see these walls, you can kind of drop down. And you're going to see... Yeah, so the, the level ends over here. Now, oops. The catch with the strat is that if I exit the physics debug, everything's invisible. You can't see anything. So I don't actually have this memorized, but you basically walk forward until you see the door, and there's some stuff that you have to move apart. I don't even see where they are. Okay, I'm looking at the wrong thing. You have to move these things blind. And it might actually be easier if you use the object to like try to clip through the door, although this is really thick, so I doubt you can actually clip through. And the level door's right there. So, I'm gonna do this one more time without the physics debug. Okay, so I guess it's actually better if you jumped over the other side so that you start on the right side and you're a little closer. Because I have to move to the right right now, but it's not a big difference. Maybe just one second. All right, so let's just set this down. Let's start the prop fly. And just start it off at a 45 degree angle. But then once you make it past here, you can start veering it off to the right. And then you want to go mostly this way. And there's that kind of corner in the pipe. And once you get past the corner, you just want to make sure you have enough height to go over. Oh, okay. Not quite. I need to go forward a little more. So I need to drop down right about here. This should be the end. You can probably just fall down without doing this. And then on the ground, there's going to be some rocks. And you can kind of make a reference with these three. So there's an object right over there. And then there's another one. Uh, where's the other object? I don't know. Right there. I think the door just moved. And there we go. That's it.